Everybody's perfect the first time. Yeah. Usually, first time our students miss everything. Yes. Their second time do a lot better. So the first time is always very hard, and then the yeah. more you do it, the easier it gets. PPS 14. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's the first thing we should be doing after this. Hydrate! Cleaning rifles. Cleaning rifles. Cleaning rifles. Cleaning rifles. Well hydrated. All right. Well hydrated. Your good. Here, here, team. Grab them. Uh, Jesus Lambert. Grab a cleaning beer. Let's go. Okay. Yes. Or you still walk? Well, oh. Eight, ice. Three, two. Let's go, guys. The command team. You if you're it. hurting, go grab ice cold water. There you go. something going on here we're gonna go ahead and send you a part ahead of time and so it's got you know we're doing our mission yeah we get it we get to interact with the grunts and the Filipino Marines and Navy so yeah I mean, if I had a tool to do this or I had you know, some huge generator that can make sticks and it, everything happens slower here we got to work with foreign nationals from a contracting stance yep. I'm Andrew Markey, uh, first lieutenant with MAX-4. So this is our early warning site. Uh, we use this, we take sensor data from sensors all over the AO. We collect them and then we send them to our multifunction air operations center, which is our control center back on mainland Okinawa. And then they use that to control aircraft, send information to adjacent units for them to use as well. It's extremely important. Uh, airspace control is an incredibly important function. Uh, maintaining air superiority, so extending our vision, extending uh, our ability to see as far out as we can uh, is very necessary for being able to contribute to the MAW. So with Force Design 2030, uh, this allows us to we're be more expeditionary, again getting eyes out as far as we can, getting as much early warning as possible for incoming threats for uh, air units, adjacent units, uh, and be able to allow them to counteract those threats as they come in. 
Yeah, so this exercise is great practice for us. It allows us to get extra rounds in and practice, our, flex our muscles a little bit and allow us just to prepare for the next, next incoming fight.